John chapter 4, verse 23. But the hour comes, and now is, when the true worshipers shall fall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. For the Father seeketh such to worship them. God, man. And who is the true worshiper, man? The, the real the real men who gonna worship the Father in truth and in spirit, man. No matter, no matter, ain't, ain't no, ain't, ain't supposed to be no emotion and feelings when it comes to these scriptures, man. The Lord ain't dealing with that. That's right. John 24 said, Yahweh is a spirit. God. They that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. God, man. So no matter if you like it or not, man, you gonna worship him. You know what I'm saying? Even if you think it's harsh. You know what I'm saying? Or you think it's fair, man. You still gonna worship them, man. The real worshipers, man. Because in the spirit, we know that it's right. You know? A lot of guys, they just be uh, the same of the gospel. Man. Trump Nation rising! You yep. going to slavery. Trump, Trump, Trump! You going to slavery, crap! <laughs> You hear me? Hey, but that's the spirit, though. Hey, but the real nation is the real man. The real Trump nation rising. But every day, the devil is going down, man. The Trump nation is rising. Hey, look. Hey, you like it? Hey, somebody get up. Psalms 49 and 11. Gone. And also, man. Yeah, hey, the spirit of these devils coming out. Yeah. Hey, he's a villain this year. Psalm chapter 49, verse 11. It says that in what thoughts is that the house shall continue forever. Hey, what that crack is? He thinks this shit's going to go on forever, man. Hey, he don't know that. Hey, all hell about the fake news. And he's going to be a motherfucking, uh, hey, Lord, really, this ass going to be a first fruit of slavery. I hope the Lord preserve his ass. Uh, hope a Mack truck get his ass off that uh, white <laughs> yeah. today. And there's dwelling places to all generations. Hey, then he actually think that hey, his grandsons and his great great grandsons are gonna be ruling our people. Oh, man. Uh, hey, that's why you roll past talking that shit. Man. Uh, I believe it's okay. No. <laughs> this is Obadiah chapter uh, one verse three, and it says, "The pride of thine heart hath deceived thee." Oh, oh, man. man. Hey, and who that's talking about, man? Esau. Hey, the pride of his heart, man. Hey, these, these you so-called white people are fucking proud. Yeah, man. Uh -huh. his ass, man. Hey, hey, so, hey, the ride pass. Hey, you don't even know what the hell we up here talking about. Hey, the first thing you speak about is Trump Nation. Uh -huh. Hey, hey, then you know, hey, these people are proud, man. Hey, but what, what, what comes before the fuck? You know? Well, all too spirit. Right, right, right. All right, what before the fuck? You know? Yeah. It's devil, hey, you got something coming. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And it says, Thou that dwellest in the cups of the rocks, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, Who shall bring me down to the ground? I'm kind of letting you know that the scriptures is talking about you so called white people. Hey, who dealt in the cups of the rocks? Hey, who dealt in the uh, in, uh, Georgia, Russia? Wow, who is the so called caveman? You feel me? Who is the so called Caucasian? Wow. Hey, which only means cave dweller. Hey, let you know, hey, though you exalt yourself, the most high is going to bring your ass down. Oh, man. Yeah. Obadiah chapter 1 verse 4 Though thou exalt thyself as the eagle And thou set thy nest among the stars Come man, hey, uh, who exalts yourself 